Hi, it's Kirsty again and my channel. This is another of my pieces that I recently did. You may have seen this in my feature video. Um, this is a small solid wood mahogany um, chest of drawers, possibly bedside table, maybe a side table. This has been done with Rust-Oleum's uh, graphite paint, graphite chalk paint, and then finished with clear lacquer. Uh, now I did try and use a clear wax on this initially, but I wasn't totally happy with the finish. So I stripped the wax off and then just gave it a coat of Rust-Oleum's lacquer. I also have finished this inside the drawers with the Rust-Oleum gold, just to pick up the accents of the brass handles. I absolutely loved the handles on this, which is the, one of the reasons why I bought this little piece. Um, so yeah, that's, that's for sale at the moment on Facebook Marketplace. Now, the lighting isn't great in my dining room here, but um, but this is uh, another of the pieces that I've completed recently. This is a half moon hallway table um, or side table. This has been finished with Rust-Oleum's Belgrave chalk paint, followed by a coat of the Rust-Oleum white wax, just to give it that uh, slightly distressed look. Um, and it's also been sanded on top and then finished with a Rust-Oleum clear wax. Um, the drawer inside has also been finished with Rust-Oleum's gold metallic paint just to pick up the accents of the brass finishes on this piece. So I'm really pleased with this. I had a lot of fun with it. Um, I actually picked this up from a local charity store that uh, collects home clearance furniture and then sells it on the profits that they make go to um helping those in need so it was quite quite a nice little find this this uh is my husband's captain's chair or admiral's chair he was a bit reluctant for me to get my hands on it and a bit nervous to say the least but he's very pleased and very proud so um i'll just talk you through this so this has been done with Rust-Oleum's uh, metallic gold as a base coat, you get a sort of hint of the gold there, um, followed by their antique white paint on top and then finished with a clear wax. So it's been distressed to kind of bring out the um, metallics there. So that's currently um, for sale at the moment and we'll see if I can, uh, I can pass this on to some new loving home. So this is the latest piece that I've created. Uh, I got this from a local charity shop for five pounds. It was a mahogany wine table, as it is known when it was created, but it's now, as I'm calling it, a gin table. Um, and it's here in my sunroom at the moment. So this has been finished with two Rust-Oleum paints. So the base coat is a Rust-Oleum cocoa which you can get a bit of a sense of underneath there and then it's been finished on top with rust-oleum's hessian paint um, and then it's been uh, sealed with the rust-oleum clear wax now i've also um, just highlighted the sort of edges with the rust-oleum gilding wax just to pick out the detail on the piece i mean i really love this piece i love the turned legs it looks really pretty and then with the ivy on top it really sets it off so yeah this is one of, this is a favorite piece of mine i really enjoyed doing this